Hello and welcome back to another Computer Sluggish tutorial. Before we get started, have you subscribed to my YouTube channel yet? If not, be sure to click on the big red subscribe button on my main page. And once you have done this, don't forget to click on that bell to be the first to get notified when I upload a new video. In today's video, I will be showing you how to fix this annoying error message that keeps popping up when you are trying to launch an application or a game. This is caused because Windows is missing a very important runtime. Lucky for us, there is a program we can download which will install all the latest runtimes for Windows. To get this, all you need to do is head on over to the link that's in the description below and you will end up on a page that looks like this. Once you are on this page, you now need to go to the right hand side here and click download. Once you have clicked on download, you will now end up on a page that looks like this and you need to go ahead and press download again and save file. And what this program is going to do is basically download the latest version of Java, the latest version of Flash Player, the latest version of Shockwave, Silverlight, Visual C++ runtimes and it will also download a few other runtimes which Windows needs to run some applications and games. Once All-in-One has finished downloading, we can now run the setup file. You now need to make sure everything is selected on the first tab, and then you need to make sure everything is selected on the second tab. Once you are happy with this, you can now go ahead and press this button here, and it will begin to install everything for you. And it really is that simple. Once All-in-One has finished installing all the runtimes, it will just close and you will end up with nothing on your screen. If you do want to make sure All-in-One did install all the runtimes correctly, then you can open up All-in-One again by simply going back to your web browser or where you saved the file to and just run in the .exe again and it will pop up with a message saying all runtimes installed successfully. And there we go, as you can see I do have a message on my screen now saying that all the runtimes were installed successfully. You can now try and open up the program or game again and it should now launch absolutely fine. If you do still get the error, try and restart your computer and that should fix the problem. I hope this tutorial has helped, if it has, hit the like button below and subscribe for more computer sluggish tutorials.